Welcome back to another basic Game Maker Studio tutorial and this time I'm going to do a quick one which is a muzzle for your gun which is just basically a thing which looks like a bullet and I give you a little secret it is the bullet so um, if you want to know how to do that in Game Maker Studio like really really fast for your game and well then stick around and for now I'm gonna completely skip my intro hi I'm one up indie hello and let's get started this is a patron request so that's why I'm gonna speed it up a little bit so basically what is a muzzle a thing which is just flashing up quite fast and of course you can have different sprite than the bullet but here I just use the same one to make a nice cool effect so let's get into my player where he just, uh, this is the player guy, and he's just creating a bullet and in the same time he's creating a muzzle and because I want my uh, bullet not to be at its X and Y position because this is the bottom center for this guy, for other sprite, I want it to be at the tip of the gun. And therefore I have like extra, uh, extra buffer X and buffer Y and so this is just like this, I create a variable then create my muzzle as well as the bullet. They have the same, well, um, origin point where they're being spawned. And then I just say, hey, to my muzzle, I need a buffer X and buffer Y. So, um, well, the, it will be spawned at the tip of the gun and at the right place. And here we can completely ignore everything because this is not important for us. And here we kill everything. So you see the whole process so the first thing is i just use this bullet so i'm using this guy here and i just use this one here and only this one i'm not taking the whole well hit animation i just take the first image and therefore i need to do one thing at the start say image speed is zero so it cannot animate then i want it to be a little bit transparent then I say image alpha, let's say for 0 0.9, so it is overlapping but not completely. Then I want it to be um, above the player, then I go for minus 3000, was it 3000? I'm, I'm not even, I don't even know. So this is just so you overlap it, but of course this is a, a little trick you can do. And then the next thing is we create an alarm of five steps so alarm zero for five and what do we do after the alarm well runs out well we destroy it we just go instance destroy and let's copy paste that and this is what we do we, we just spam that thing and then after five seconds it is gone and for now for example now we could start the game and shoot and as you can see it already works and it's basically it looks like the the same bullet which we are shooting but for example a muzzle flash is a little bit bigger than the bullet itself and therefore we do a few little tricks so we go and take its image x and y scale make it definitely smaller and in our step event which is just well for five steps we say we take the image x and y scale and add every step 0.3 so this is then already pretty sweet and let's check this out bam 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 as you can see already looks better but let's make it a little bit bigger let's uh, let's go for 0 0.5 and then we are gonna hit to one little problem which i'm gonna see now for example we are and let's zoom in so you can actually see it for example when we are idle or let's say stationary no problem we are attacking in the right direction but for example once we are moving damn it is on us it's delayed and therefore we have to do a little trick which is well not too complicated in our step event we update our x and y position towards our player so it's this guy player x plus and then i have a little variable which i call buffer x and buffer y which i just showed you so we 
when the player is moving then our X position will be moving too plus the static well buffer which is let's say to the right or to the left and that of course we can do to the player so Y position but for example he can jump so we need to stick around as well on the Y position and now let's check it out because well, we are pretty much done that was the whole magic thing here no 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 zoom 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 as you can see bam it's every time there and the muzzle is kind of following sticking to one position which is just here or here at the tip of the gun and it stays there because it follows the player of course be careful because um, the player needs to be around therefore it would throw an arrow for example if the enemy well the the player is gone then maybe you have to do something if instance exists so Hopefully that uh, solved your problem mate, because that was a Patreon exclusive request, have a good one, one up indie.